Hello friends, welcome to HadoopBigDataTutorial.com powered by Wisdom Trainings. In this video, we're going to talk about the scope and future of Big Data. So if we look at this term Big Data, this term is not going to die out any sooner now because everything nowadays generates huge amount of data, be it your mobile phones, be it your social networking platforms, be it your sensors in industries and even at your homes. So each and everything generates huge amount of data. And the next big thing that is coming in way which will be major contributor to this big data is IoT which is Internet of Things wherein each and every household item and each and everything that you see around your workplaces and homes will be connected to internet and it will be producing huge amount of data. Right. So this big data term is not going to die out. It has become immortal. Believe me, it's immortal now. Right. Now it's not only the big data is not only about generating huge amount of data. So this data is not uh, useful even uh, you know if you are not able to extract something out of it. So you need to extract value out of data. So if big data is not only about the size of data, rather it's about the value within the data. So let us see what all the values that you can extract out of this big data. I have listed few of them here. So the very first thing that I have listed is cost reduction. So you can target those areas which are trivial in nature. So in an enterprise, you can target those areas which are trivial in nature or which are of least importance, and you can help your uh, your enterprise to you know reduce the cost. Okay. If you talk about faster and better decision making, you will get the results. You will get the faster analysis uh, out of the big data, and you can you know take decisions very quickly, and it will be uh, beneficial for your businesses. Uh, new products and services uh, based on the customer preferences you can develop new products and services what customer is actually interested in you can get that insight using that big data of the customers preferences right performing uh, risk analysis uh, for financial sector and for stock exchanges and for the investors wherein they need to invest huge amount of data or huge amount of money in you know bigger stocks and right so they can perform risk analysis whether to invest in a particular company based on the previous records so previous big data will be uh, you know analyzed and processed and you know insights can get out of that and they can perform risk analysis making our city smarter okay so everything will now be connected to internet and cities will become smart so they'll be producing huge amount of data and things can be controlled using that you know by doing the analysis and processing of that big data customizing your website in real time based on uh, user preferences or the custom preferences uh, gender and all so you can customize your website in real time so if i am visiting your website if somebody else is visiting the website so the website will be aware of the fact that what i'm interested in so that can be done using big data analysis reducing maintenance codes you know in the industries uh, their components has to be changed very frequently because there is a lot of wear and tear so each component will be generating huge amount of data so that can be analyzed and processed and exact wear and tear can be calculated and you know the components which have not wear and torn out you know can be avoided to you know replaced so this will you know help you reduce maintenance cost so all these things can be done using the big data analytics or this is the value that you can extract out of the big data so you need something you need a technology where with with the help of which uh, you can work on big data so the th next thing that i'm going to talk is about hadoop so hadoop will carry the load of big data so this is hadoop sh you know it is carrying the load of your big data here and you, know, you can analyze the data at a very low cost right and at a very faster space faster pace so big data can be you know managed with the help of hadoop framework so we must learn Hadoop. So if I talk about the careers and uh, careers in big data and Hadoop. So job opportunities, what all things you can opt for, you can become a Hadoop architect, you can become a Hadoop developer, data scientist and Hadoop administrator. So these are various options available in big data or Hadoop domain. Uh, you know, I'm no one to tell you about the facts, you know, about, you know, wh what uh, the scope and future of this big data and Hadoop. The facts it is, itself speaks that, you know, the next big thing uh, in the market is big data and you need tech people with the skills and technology with which they'll be able to work on big data, right? So Hadoop is one of them. So increase the number of Hadoop jobs. You can say this, indeed.com, Hadoop jobs, Amazon, eBay, these are the number of, uh, you know, big giants here. Uh, City Grid, Media, Flurry, Netflix, VMware, Cloudera, EMC, Microsoft. So all these companies uh, have hu uh, you know big number of people. They require big number of people down the line with uh, people who are from Hadoop background or from you know big data background. 
so learn hadoop to make big money with hadoop uh, big data hadoop jobs right so largest employer of hadoop skills as on february 2014 so b these are big names cisco hp tata tata linkedin or oracle etc so percentage of total linkedin profiles mentioning hadoop you see this it is keep on increasing if you talk about the linkedin uh, which is a, a you know networking website for the professionals so hadoop keyword is being used uh, you know now it is very frequently because everybody wants to get a good job and wants to earn big money so for that learn hadoop big data right if you talk about hadoop technology companies these are the few of the names that i have mentioned here uh, dell amazon web services that is aws ibm mapr uh, pentaho hortonworks cloudera etc so these are the companies which are dealing uh, with hadoop technologies okay so who should learn hadoop so hadoop has become a must know technology for the following professionals if you are an analytical professional you are bi business intelligence etl w tw professionals project managers even testing professionals mainframe professionals software developers and architects and graduates aiming to build a successful career around big data should learn hadoop so this technology has become a must know for all the professionals here so if you see i have listed all the professionals so it is must for everyone here nobody is exempted from not knowing hadoop right so it is for everyone okay so come and hadoop, learn hadoop with hadoop big data tutorial dot com okay so before i you know close this video i need to show you some uh, you know articles here okay so if i go to dice dot com and i have searched for hadoop jobs i have mentioned the skill here you can see there are two eight zero eight positions in the us alone right hadoop jobs and if you talk about the noki dot com which is a uh, you know job search portal in india so you can see the number of hadoop jobs it's 5017 it's a big number right and i i was going through a recent article which was published on may 8 2016 so they're saying the data scientists are earning more than ca's and engineers so these are the data scientists who are aware of the big data technologies and all so you can learn this big data technology and go for uh, data scientist certifications and hadoop developer certifications etc right Uh, if we talk about the enterprises who are going to invest in big data, so 56% of the enterprises will increase the investment in big data over the next three years. So this is an article from the Forbes. Okay, uh, big data 20 mind-boggling, uh, you know, facts. So this is again Bernard Mar, which is a who writes about big data analytics and enterprise performance. So he has mentioned the you know scope of big data very clearly that how the big data will be increasing and what all companies are going to invest and. So, so the one thing is very sure that the data is going to increase, and at a very huge amount of data, a huge amount of rate. Sorry. So this pace will keep on increasing. The big data will keep on increasing. So enterprises and companies need professionals who are uh, good enough to handle this big data and perform analysis and process the data. So Hadoop is a technology that you must go for and learn with. Okay. So come and learn Hadoop with. hadoopbigdata.tutorial.com thanks